Okay, so to determine the phase shift of a function, we're trying to figure out how far horizontally this function is moving. So we use this sort of general form. We have y equals a sine of bx minus c over d, I mean plus d. And the first thing we need to do is just label all of these on these functions. So here, this would be our a, this would be our b, if you notice our C, we need to change the sign because of that negative right here. So C is going to be a positive 4. And then this is our D. On this equation down here, we can do the same thing and say that our A is 4. And now notice that I have my B switched. B is the one that should be with the variable. So this would be our B. So in this case, our C is going to be negative 6 because this is a positive up here. And then this last one is going to be our D. Now, if we were looking for all of the different parts of it, the amplitude, the um, period, the phase shift, and the vertical shift, we could use these formulas. But right now, this question is only asking us for the phase shift. So this is the only formula I'm concerned with. So if we look at here, we have C is 4 and B is 3. So in this case, our phase shift is going to be 4 over 3. And on this one, our phase shift, we follow the same method, is going to be negative 6 over 12, which could be reduced to negative 1 half. And so those would be our answers.